a game called Hollywood Director. Uh, usually, what we ask for is the title of a film, or a, a, well, I should say, it's a film title that you think would make a good film. Because we don't want a film that exists, we'd like to present a brand new one, or edited highlights of a brand new one for you. I'll be the director, Chris and Nat will be uh, everyone I need them to be in it. However, because it's Christmas, let's have a festive themed film. Whatever you like, uh, you can blend some together or come up with a brand new one, whatever you like. So let's hear some ideas. The Abominable Snowman. The oh. Abominable Snowman, strong start. What else? Since somebody's engine snowballs down. <laughs> oh, I was just brainstorming. I really want to include no. snowballs. You're going to put those in there. Okay. Blue sky, guys. Blue sky. Come on. Spitball in here. Bailey's for breakfast. Bailey's for breakfast. <laughs> yes. Sorry. <laughs> no, no. It just sounds like the start of a fine, fine list. Anything else? Missile no. <laughs> so dumb. Missile no. That's strong. Okay, uh, who would like, <laughs> sounds like I'm buying, who would like Bailey's for breakfast? <laughs> okay, and as a movie title? Anyway, um, uh, who would like Missile No? Yeah! Okay, and uh, what was the other one? Uh, the Abominable Snowman. <laughs> <laughs> missile No. Alright then. Okay, so Missile No is the name of the film. <laughs> Welcome, up we get, we're going to have the opening scene of Missile No. <laughs> Things are getting very, very heated at the average Joe's house. You're just average Joe's getting ready for Christmas, and you're wondering about what decorations to put up. Some of you are thinking traditional, some of you are thinking not. But we're just going to see there, I'm just going to vibe with the festive feeling. Action! Oh, I've got the box of tinsel out, there we go. No, 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 we're not having that. No. Why not? We're not having tinsel in this house. What? Why it's not? Gooch. Oh, <laughs> this tinsel's beautiful. Oh, no, it makes me feel violently ill. Well, what would you suggest? We are going to have the concept of tinsel. <laughs> what is that exactly? Exactly! It's what you make it. What I want to do is put one small thin piece of string around the tree, and that will be the concept of tinsel. And then you're not allowed to approach it or look at it head on, but you just think about it <laughs> and what it means to you. Okay, guys. <laughs> I've changed my mind. We're going to, <laughs> we're going to, uh, we're going to take this. Uh, we're going to go to <laughs> your life. <Yeah. laughs> Everything from the age of about 20 onwards, I think. Anyway, um, so uh, you're, uh, we, we, we've changed this. What's going to happen is um, you are going to be, um, going to be selling mistletoe. Right. Door to door. <laughs> You're all of the doors. <laughs> people behind them. Okay. Um, but do be the door as well. Yeah. Um, so you're going to go, you're going to be trying to say, but you know what? Mistletoe is not as popular as it used to be. You're getting a lot of negativity. So I would say the word no is coming up quite a lot. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I, I mean, the producer's got it, yes. So, uh, so uh, let's see some of that happening, please. <laughs> oh, Cass! <laughs> you didn't hear me say that she was going to be the doors as well as the people behind oh, the doors. Oh, sorry, yeah. yeah. Okay, I can't sorry. work I'm with these people. people. I just can't fucking well, work with them. You know can. Do you know why? Because you're a pro. Yeah. By pro, I mean active sex worker. Yeah. Action! <laughs> <laughs> mistletoe! Do you mistletoe? <laughs> Hello there, missus. Would you like some cheeky mistletoe? Ah, oh, hey, keep that away from me. I've got allergies. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's me smell like a balloon, it does. Oh, right, OK. Yeah. You don't need any mistletoe. No, I haven't afford it. Biggie's cursed. My hair was closing up. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Eva. I'll move on to another door. Bloody hell, it's not going well for me today. That's 50 doors that I've been to already. <laughs> Oh, it's a weird door, this one. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> it, I'll just help me. Hello! Ah! Mistletoe, Sarah! Do you want some mistletoe, darling? I'm sorry, who are you? I'm mistletoe, Sarah, cheeky and all that. Do you want some mistletoe? I don't know don't like people like you around here. This please. is a nice neighbourhood. Please, please, get me the water and the broom! Just buy some mistletoe. Oh, yeah, mistletoe. Oh, come on! 
Okay, <laughs> cut. <laughs> I was really you're feeling very, very big door there. No, you're like a no, I've felt it. Good. We don't need you for this scene. Okay. <laughs> you're at your lowest, Dad. Yeah. <laughs> you got a basket full of mistletoe and a heart full of woe. <laughs> so, uh, I just want to hear a very long monologue about how you're giving up on the idea. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was going to be a poem. But a very long monologue <laughs> on, uh, on how you feel. You feel sort of old-fashioned, you feel out of place, you feel like, you know, you don't belong anymore, all because of your love of mistletoe and all of the kissing. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hear that for a couple of days. Cool! Blimey, Governor! <laughs> <laughs> it looks like me and my traditional mistletoe ways are no longer needed on the streets of good old London. <laughs> Maybe I am a little behind the times, but I've still got mistletoe in my heart. I want to snog some proper birds with it and all that. <laughs> but I guess maybe it's time to put down the mistletoe basket and uh, throw myself in the tents. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cut. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, your house is on the way to the tents and you decide to go there and get some sleep. During this sleep, you're visited by three spirits. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> mistletoe past, mistletoe present, <laughs> and mistletoe yet to come. <laughs> That's you, by the way. <laughs> so, uh, you finally get back into the spirit of mistletoe. You find out what, what it meant to people, what it means to people now, and what it's going to be like in the future. <laughs> so let's watch that happen. Action! Cool! Can't wait to jump in that canal. That's <laughs> <laughs> it. Oh dear. Oh, my house is here. Maybe I'll pop in and uh, make sure I've turned stuff off before I commit suicide. <laughs> <laughs> now, maybe I feel a bit tired. Maybe I'll get, maybe I'll get a bit of sleep. Then I'll come throw myself in the tent. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll probably become asleep. <laughs> oh, sorry, mate. I'll come back in a minute. <laughs> I'm going to call this one Teresa Mistletoe May. Oh, no, 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 I'm dressed like the HR rep that works in your mistletoe factory. Oh, yeah, I yes. recognise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. yes, I'm here to tell you that um, we forgive you for the Theresa Mistletoe May thing. Mm. You, didn't, you didn't know anything about that. But, uh, yeah, oh, you can't throw yourself in the tent because in about two weeks there's going to be a terrible mistletoe shortage and you're the only place people will get it from. Really? Yes. Hop, skibbity, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Johnny Cockney? I need him right now. Oh, He's the only person who can distribute all of this mistletoe. Oh, we got so many kissless Christmases. <laughs> See? You see what happens? Wow, so I am needed with my mistletoe after all. Yes, but so don't kill yourself, but do go back to sleep because there's another ghost and you're not supposed to realise that yet, dickhead. Right, okay. Mistletoe. <laughs> 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 I think I left a mistletoe basket in the street coming. Oh, oh, oh my god. What is that? You've got mistletoe. <laughs> But you look like death and now you're pointing over there. What are you pointing at? I just have no idea where to kiss. 
<laughs> oh my god! <laughs> That's where am I supposed to kiss? <laughs> It's somebody who hasn't got any mistletoe. Oh, 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 oh. oh look, they're stood near a grave as well. That's covered in mistletoe. Let me brush this mistletoe away. Kissing. Oh, the kiss of death. Oh my God. I, I, I can mend my ways. I can get out and I can give mistletoe to everyone again. Please don't throw me in that grave, you bastards. Oh, oh, I'm awake. My God, it's mistletoe morning, I haven't missed it. <laughs> Maybe there's still time to distribute the mistletoe. <laughs> Oi, you little cocky bastard. <laughs> what do you want, Nicker? I'm busy. Quick, take this mistletoe branch. Fuck <laughs> off. No, I'll take it. Spread the mistletoe oh, around. I'm blind. No, you're not. <laughs> Mistletoe. I'm gonna give everybody free mistletoe, are you? Yay! Woo! <laughs> God bless us everyone. That was only the director. That was Missile No. And then at the end, because you've been watching Missile No, and then a big yes comes along and kicks the no off of it. So you're actually watching nice. Missile Yes, which isn't even a punk. <laughs>